so much for watching if you are new welcome my name is Daniela and for today's video I'm bringing you this glossy and matte makeup look you can totally change the color to make it more wearable but yes if you like this video don't forget to subscribe it's free or give this video a thumbs up if you like it so if you want to know how to achieve this look Let's keep watching. Alright, so I will start as usual with my cheapy concealer, but it's really good to act as an eyeshadow base. But just use any concealer that you have, and I'm just going to apply this all over the lid. You have seen me doing this <laughs> so many times. And in case you are wondering, this concealer is by the brand Veronica Conti. I've never heard anything of it, but... I would love if you guys would tell me your favorite song at the moment because I'm like stuck with the same music and I would really like to hear something new. Please let me know your favorite song. Alright, so I will only be using one eyeshadow and it will be this matte red eyeshadow. So I will start applying it from the lash line towards the crease. And you want to concentrate the color on the lid. So you just want to keep packing the color near the lash line and then blending it towards the crease. The reason I'm blending with the concealer brush is because I haven't washed my brushes and as I'm going out tonight I can't wash them like right now because it takes so long for them to really dry. So you just gotta work with what you have. So I'm just keep, um, I'll keep blending and adding eyeshadow until I'm happy with how it looks. I'm moving to my foundation. No, okay, <laughs> closed the curtain a little, but I'm just applying one pump of the same foundation that I always use. I really hope you can see what I'm doing because of the sun. I should really get a ring light or something because natural light doesn't always work. And then the usual, I'm going to highlight and conceal with my LA Girl HD for concealer in the shade Porcelain. So I'll set my concealer using that highlight shade gold sun. For setting my foundation, I'm using this translucent powder by Goff in the shade GA100 and this was like the best translucent powder but they discontinued it and they changed the formula and this is not transparent as you can see uh, so I cannot always use this.
I will contour my face using the shade Espresso, which is that one in the middle. For blush, I'll take my Wishes Come True palette by Sephora and I'll take this blush called Feeling Pretty. For highlight, I'm going to take Nighttime Glow from the same Sephora palette and I'll just apply that all over the places I want to highlight. So I just filled in my eyebrows using eyeshadow and I will move to the eyes again and I'm taking that same red eyeshadow and I will just apply it all along the lower lash line, nothing special. That and I will just um, curl my lashes and then apply some mascara. Alright, so I just applied some false eyelashes off camera and then I covered the glue with liquid eyeliner. But that is everything guys, I'm really sorry about the lighting, but I hope I can fix that for the next video. <laughs> I still have to figure out in which hour to film, but thank you so much for watching. And if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe, it's totally free, and give this video a thumbs up. Bye guys!